What's good, friends and family? Mr. Flip Flop here again. So getting ready to hit that carnival up for Sunday. Um, so, Sasu updates. First off, um, people keep asking. Classicos are still closed. Uh, Flow is still closed. Roomba is currently open. They opened up. Um, so we'll see what happens. As I said, they're still closed right now. But let's get to the main topic of this uh, Sasu updates, which is the elections. Everybody keeps asking about the elections and what happened. So first off, if you guys don't know, uh, we have some Paradise Life events coming up. Make sure you hit me up. Uh, I believe uh, April 4th, we have a big event. Uh, the whole weekend of April. And in Semana Santa, we're doing something up also. So hit us up for the Paradise Life events. Shout to Paradise Life. Let's get into this. Now, on um, April 16th, right? Excuse me. April 16th was the general elections, meaning the municipal elections, um, the local government elections. Uh, they put in a $19 million, $19 million system of uh, digital elections, whatever. So four hours in, there was a problem. They canceled the elections and for technical difficulties and people went, uh, went nuts. So um, April 17th, Still no answers. Nobody's being held accountable. Uh, they rescheduled for the 15th of March, the elections. Now, just to give you an idea, so for elections, you could not sell alcohol. No business in the country could sell alcohol from Saturday morning at 6 a.m. until Sunday morning, until Monday morning at 6 a.m. So every business, disco, uh, bar, Carmado, no one could sell alcohol from 6 a.m. Saturday to 6 a.m. Monday. So you basically have people closing for two days, losing business because of the elections. What happened was, once they rescheduled the elections, most places opened up. So a lot of businesses has lost money for a, a day and a half on a weekend. So you can imagine how angry a lot of business owners were, let alone the... the local people in the government and the uh, locals in Dominican Republic as well as New York and all Dominicans in the USA. So on the 17th, still no answers, still don't know what's going on, um, no, one, no information. So people are pissed, people start protesting. They had a peaceful protest at the uh, Board of Elections in uh, Santo Domingo. Um, nothing was going on. They, they, they just, everybody just wants answers. You know what I'm saying? Uh, on the 18th, they had another peaceful protest, which thousands came out, and you'll see a picture on here uh, after, the, after this, um, this commentary. Thousands came out and were protesting, looking for answers. You know, like, we spent $19 million, we wanted to vote, there's a glitch in the system. Allegedly, there was there's few versions, whatever version you want to believe, some people were missing from the ballot, some people couldn't vote at all, um, certain parties were not listed on the ballot. It was a lot of... There's a lot of different versions of it, depending on what area you're in, but uh, it was a big glitch in the elections. Now, on the 18th, when thousands came out for a peaceful protest, they threw tear gas bombs. So people were even more pissed. Like, we're out here protesting peacefully and you're throwing tear gas bombs, and the government still has not given an answer to what's going on. They just said, we're rescheduling for the 15th, glitch in the system, that's it. The government claimed it's not their fault. One party claimed it's not their fault. The other party claimed it's not their fault. So as far as the election, so you guys understand, there was a glitch in this brand new shiny system and there are tons of protests going on all around the country here, uh, all around America. I've seen protests in New York as well because the Dominicans are trying to figure out what's going on, where's the democracy is, is what's going on. They're saying, where's the democracy? 
So that's what's going on with the elections. Everybody keeps saying, what happened with the elections? What happened? Well, there were no elections. The elections were suspended and rescheduled for March 15th. So that's just give you a heads up on the updates, let you guys know what's going on. I know a lot of people are asking me. Um, I don't follow politics myself too much, but this is what the ins and outs of what's going on. Uh, so basically, the new system, glitching the system, as they say, and they reschedule for the 15th, and people are constantly protesting. I'll post up a schedule. A lot of protests are coming up in, in the States as well about what's going on because people are angry that uh, they spend so much money and they can't get a, a real uh, vote in, you know. No real um, competition as far as the votes go. So you guys be good. Got more coming. Mr. Flip Flop, I'm out.